In the labyrinth of true crime narratives, few stories have ignited as much intrigue, speculation, and controversy as the unresolved murder of Jean Benet Ramsey. In the early hours of December 26, 1996, the lifeless body of the six year old beauty queen was discovered in the basement of her family home in Boulder, Colorado. Today, we embark on a comprehensive exploration of the captivating saga of Jean Benet Ramsey, peeling back the layers of mystery surrounding her tragic death, the intricate investigations that ensued, the web of suspects entangled in the case and the enduring impact that this unresolved mystery has left on the landscape of true crime. Jean Benet Ramsey's journey into the public eye began in the glittering world of child beauty pageants. A cherubic six-year-old with golden curls and an infectious smile, she became a fixture in these competitions, capturing the attention of judges and spectators alike. However, this seemingly idyllic world of innocence would soon become the backdrop for a tragedy that continues to baffle investigators and armchair detectives. At the center of the Jean Benet Ramsey case is the Ramsey family, John and Patsy Ramsey, along with their son, Burke. The affluent family was well known in their community, and Patsy, in particular, played a prominent role in Jean Benet's pageant pursuits. The idyllic facade, however, crumbled on that fateful December day, leaving behind a fractured family, a grieving community, and a litany of unanswered questions. The day after Christmas took a sinister turn when Patsy Ramsey made a harrowing 911 call reporting the apparent kidnapping of Jean Benet. In the ransom note left behind, the kidnapper demanded a sum eerily close to John Ramsey's bonus. The police were summoned and the house was searched, but the grim discovery of Jean Benet's lifeless body in the basement threw the investigation into disarray. The crime scene presented investigators with a baffling puzzle. Jean Benet's body lay in the wine cellar, bound and gagged, with a ligature around her neck. The peculiar details of the crime scene, including the ransom note, the absence of an obvious point of entry, and the perplexing mix of evidence— fueled speculation, and ignited debates that persist to this day. As news of Jean Benet's death reverberated, the Boulder Police Department shifted its focus to the Ramsey family. Suspicion centered on the possibility of an inside job, with theories suggesting that one of the family members was involved in a crime that had spiraled out of control. The media scrutiny intensified, casting a shadow on the grieving family. The mysterious ransom note found inside the Ramsey home became a focal point of the investigation. Its unusual length, seemingly theatrical language, and the fact that it was written on a notepad from within the Ramsey residence perplexed investigators. Theories ranged from an intruder concocting an elaborate cover-up to Patsy Ramsey herself being the author adding layers of complexity to an already confounding case. The possibility of an intruder entering the Ramsey home and committing the crime gained traction, fueled by theories that pointed to the lack of clear evidence implicating the family. Speculation ranged from a deranged outsider with a personal vendetta to a random intruder taking advantage of lax security measures. However, the absence of a clear motive and the intricacies of the crime scene raised questions about the plausibility of an outsider committing such a heinous act. Conversely, theories implicating the Ramsey family and Jean Benet's death gained prominence. The intricate dynamics within the family, coupled with the suspicions surrounding the ransom note and the lack of forced entry, led some to believe that the Ramseys were concealing a dark secret. The notion of a staged kidnapping gone wrong or an accident covered up to protect the family's reputation added layers of complexity to the narrative. The crime scene itself became a canvas for various theories. Some argued that the intricacies of the ligature and the specific manner in which Jean Benet was found suggested a crime with symbolic elements. Others contended that the lack of obvious signs of a break-in pointed to an inside job. Theories multiplied, each presenting a unique perspective on what transpired that tragic night. 
The Jean Benet Ramsey case became a media sensation, capturing the public's imagination and thrusting the family into the harsh spotlight. The saturation coverage, fueled by sensational headlines and speculative reporting, transformed the case into a spectacle. The media circus not only shaped public perception, but also fueled a wave of armchair detective work and amateur sleuthing. The court of public opinion became a battleground of competing narratives, with armchair detectives and amateur sleuths dissecting every piece of available information. Online forums and true crime communities became breeding grounds for speculation, conspiracy theories, and attempts to unravel the mystery independently. The collective fascination with the case transcended the bounds of traditional journalism, creating a subculture of dedicated individuals seeking to crack the code of John Bonet's tragic demise. In the years that followed John Bonet's death, legal proceedings against the Ramses took various turns. The family endured the weight of suspicion, media scrutiny, and legal battles. In 2008, the Boulder District Attorney publicly exonerated the Ramsey family, citing DNA evidence that did not match any family member. Despite this, the case remains officially unsolved, leaving a lingering cloud of uncertainty over the tragic events of that December night. The Jean Bonnet Ramsey case left an enduring mark on the true crime landscape. Its legacy is marked by the media's influence on public perception, the proliferation of conspiracy theories, and the complexities of high-profile investigations. The case became a cultural touchstone, influencing subsequent true crime narratives and shaping discussions on the ethics of media coverage and the challenges of navigating high-profile cases. The unsolved murder of Jean Benet Ramsey continues to captivate the public's imagination, becoming a symbol of true crime intrigue and mystery. The case remains a labyrinth of unanswered questions, with theories and speculations intertwining in a complex web of possibilities. Jean Benet's story remains a haunting reminder of the complexities that can shroud even the most high profile investigations leaving us with a lingering sense of unease and a multitude of unresolved questions that echo through the corridors of true crime history. Join me in exploring the intricacies of Jean Benet Ramsey's case, a story that transcends the boundaries of true crime and challenges our understanding of justice. If you found this exploration intriguing, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share your thoughts below. Until next time, keep questioning, keep searching, and stay curious. Together, let's uncover the secrets hidden in the shadows.